Uh, going for another practice run. See, this is too loose. It's gonna vibrate. Look. Um, what I don't like about this bike is that it don't have a odometer where I can actually see my RPMs. But I guess I could go off the uh, switching the gears off the speedometer. Hold on, go into. It was a nice little curve there. I'm trying to remain focused on um, trying not to get in the middle where the, uh, the vehicles, when they drive, every vehicle at some point, uh, <laughs> they leak oil and all types of fluids in the middle. But then in our neighborhood, they kind of ride in the center of the road, so it's kind of hard to tell. Only when you feel like that slick patch, you're like, oh, there, there's some um, oil right there. Ooh, gravel. Ooh. More gravel. Made it. Okay. Use my signal lights. Gotta make sure I remember to use my signal lights. <laughs> and the clutch. Turn it off. Okay, that was second gear. Drop back down to first, and ooh, uh, yeah, I dumped the clutch. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Embarrassing, but I am practicing, so. It's a lot of dick about when you're riding, but uh, once you get it, it's uh, kind of intuitive. Gotta remember not to rev it too much when I'm trying to switch gears. Just give it a little bit of gas, or let off the gla um, the the gas. I think I go this way. I left 
my turn signal on. <laughs> I gotta polish up on my skills. Oh my gosh. I think that might have been third gear, but I'm not sure. There's no way to tell. I'll correct that. And I just blew past that sign. <laughs> I'm trying not to cover any of these clutches, the clutch or the brake. Um, but I know that's why I'd be covering one of these, uh, probably the clutch or the brake. Just, just like and if you jerk, it's gonna, um, you could jerk the brake or you could, well, the clutch won't matter, so I guess it'd be okay to cover the clutch. And I got always remember to use my rear brake. Oh, I think I hit an old patch right there. Yeah, I was in a second there. I think I'm gonna need a, a, a gear indicator, which tells me uh, which gear I am, so I won't forget. <laughs> All right. Now that's third gear. Now I'm getting up to 35. I think that might have been second gear, but uh, yep, I'm still second gear. Now, when I rode on this the, uh, uh, yesterday, <laughs> uh, I surely couldn't tell where the, uh, the slick spots were. Because on a normal road, they had defined areas. You can't go past the line. There is no lines in our subdivision. So when people have parked cars like this, it's kind of hard to discern. discern. <laughs> oh, hold on. Oh, some kids. Uh, I think they're, they're trying to race me or something. They, they better not. See, yes, they are. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I'm not having that. I'm out here practicing. Practice? Yeah, we talk about practice. <laughs> Don't he know this could go really fast? I'm just trying, trying not to overdo my ability. Oh, hey. And I wanna make sure I get these down, packed before I take it to the road. All right, um, there's nobody coming. Stop and go.
What are you doing? Yeah, there's some people cut more than they lawn too, so it's I'm trying to make sure that I don't go over any grass clippings. Grass clippings, I see glass. <laughs> I still haven't downshifted yet. But there is one thing I need to practice on. Going uphill. And started from uphill. Kinda yeah, I was out of shift. Yeah. Is that the word for it? I was out of gear. That's the word for it. There we go, second gear. Oh, watch out for him. I may have to slow down a bit. And I'm using my uh, front brake and my rear brake at the same time, gently, so I won't get thrown over the, and I'm not like squeezing it so hard either. Ooh, there was a uh, cover spot there. Not curvy spot, but um, it was a slippery spot. I felt it, um, my tire was about to give a <laughs> move for my niece and me, under me. When I'm actually on the road, when I actually finally get ready on the ro to be on the road, I should be on this side of the road. But uh, in this neighborhood, you can't really tell who be coming down the middle of the road. So I don't want to get hit with oncoming traffic. This way I can see, if, you know, both sides. From people coming out the driveway and, um, well, I guess I could see from the middle of the lane too. I'm gonna come to a complete stop now. So I can practice it and be comfortable landing off the clutch and getting on the gas. Like that. And I'm gonna come to a complete stop here too. I see a FedEx behind me. <laughs> All right. Uh. Yep, he's still behind me. Signal light, let him know what's going on, what's about to go down. Rear brake. Ooh, this bike gets hot. Well, I guess any bike would get hot. We ride it for a length of time. Sitting on the engine and a gas tank. Will somebody into the this way? And we got traffic. Which I probably need to practice on. So yeah, I gotta look out for people like that that don't really see me. They see me there, but they don't see me. Right 
this make perfect. It's like a, a ballet almost. You gotta re remember to do everything. <laughs> Because the car, I mean the motorcycle, is not going to do it for you. I don't like it when they jerk like that. How can I stop it from jerking when I uh, switch gears? Can I just do it? Is there a cleaner way, like letting off the uh, gas here? Let me try. Um, brake a little. Downshift. Give it some lipid gas. Of course I'm at first, but it never feels when I come to this stop sign that uh, a car comes or two. Could please stop. Look both three directions. It's a full way. Uh, that was a little bit smooth. Whoa! I didn't see that. <laughs> I should have, but I I didn't see that. Gonna be stationary? I think so. See, that was smooth. I, I guess I gotta let off the, the throttle, but if you gotta, if you got somebody behind you, you let off the throttle, won't that slow you down and someone behind you could hit you? But I guess you gotta do it quick, but uh, that's where the reflexes come in, I guess. Yeah. I'm trying to push myself to get better because I don't really like driving, riding on these, uh, these type of roads because it's hard to discern where I should be at, where I should be riding. Oh, got a lot of activity. I probably should just let it fall backwards a little bit. Well, roll backwards. Fall back sounds so dramatic. Yeah, I feel in the heat now. The sun is baking. All right. I'm guessing I'm on a typical hill. Well, give it more challenge. There we go. Now if I stop on the hill, and I got the clutch hold, the brake hold, the front brake, and my feet is flat. So, how to give it gas at the same time? Hmm. I should be wearing a protective jacket so I won't um so I feel more confident <laughs> in case I do fall. But I'm gonna give it a shot. <laughs> and yeah, I let off the uh clutch there. Alright.
I'm gonna let off the brake, then give it some gas. See, that's, I do not understand how that, I guess that's why we practice, that's why I'm practicing. Okay. That time I let off the clutch. So do I just roll backwards, let myself roll backwards and go forward? Let's try that. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't do it at the same time. Okay. Let's get on up in here. If I roll back anymore, I know I could actually get up. <laughs> Oh, there we go. I should try that one more time. All right. And let off the brake and operate it like normal. The reason why I'm practicing this is that because on that side of the uh, subdivision, um, the back way, quote unquote, um, that's kind of redundant. I do both and say do this and say quote unquote. That's redundant. But um, through the back way, it's um, it's a hill almost as steep as this hill on my driveway, where you have to go from the neighborhood road to Old Fannin Road. And Old Fannin is usually very busy. So I have to practice, if I'm gonna use that way, <laughs> to get out the subdivision, I have to practice getting up on the hill and going off, you know, without stalling. Now the other way, the, uh, the front of the subdivision where the actual sign is, um, it's usually, it's very level, so. That's no problem. But I'm gonna try it one more time, then I'm gonna pit Rhonda up into her sleeping place. Ooh. Control descent. <laughs> it's not halfway up right here. Uh, and I need to mow my grass. Um, I'll do it this weekend. And I also get a haircut. I'm looking at the mirror like I can see my hair. <laughs> yeah, I got my shades on because um, it's particularly sh sunny. It's sunny is not shiny. Okay, here we go. Let off the brake here, then operate like normal. All right. Yeah. See, I don't want to be doing this over that way. So. Let's try that again. Let this off and operate like normal. Give it gas, give it gas, gas. Hold up, wait, before, if I happen to fall backwards, I don't want to run into this, uh, fall into this car. All right. <laughs> I was going too slow. I gotta focus. All right. Break. See, then again, I don't want to be doing that either. Rolling backwards while I should be going forward. There'll be no bueno.
All right. Oh, it's getting hot. Okay. Help if I use the rear brake as well. But I need my balance. All right. Yeah, that'll do. But I just gotta keep practicing on that. Alright. 